You won't need anything for your practice today. But before we begin, let's set our intention. Actually, let's let our intention choose us. So I'm going to lay out four intention cards face down. I want you to pick whichever one jumps out to you first. Now let me flip them over. And the card that you chose will be your intention for your practice today. Keep it in your mind or write it down. And when you're ready, let's begin an extended child's pose on our mats. Bring your big toes a touch behind you. Walk your arms out long in front of you. Rest your forehead down onto your mat and let your chest and belly fall towards your mat. With your eyes gently closed, keep your intention in mind and deepen your breath in and out through your nose. From here, slowly rise into a tabletop on your hands and knees, and then for cow pose, drop your belly and lift your chin. Roll open through your heart. Take a big inhale. Exhale, curl your toes under and lift your hips high for downward facing dog, reaching your hips high and back. Press your chest towards your thighs and it's okay to have a little bend in your knees. Feel length in your spine and openness through your heart. And on your next inhale, look up to your hands, bend your knees. As you exhale, step your feet all the way through, take a seat on your mat. Bring the soles of your feet together and let your knees come open for a butterfly. Give yourself some space today between your hips and your heels, even walking your hips out from behind you. And take your hands to your feet, big inhale to lift up through your chest, lengthen your spine. Then exhale, fold forward, hinge at your hips, Relax your shoulders and let your head hang heavy. And do your best to relax your thighs. There's no need to press or push. Allow your body to soften into place with each deep exhale. Feel your breath travel up and down your spine. Releasing tension and creating space with each and every breath.
Take your time as you slowly rise. Pull your knees together and come to lie down on your back for a full wind pose. Just hold your knees to your chest and relax your shoulders. Allow your spine to melt into your mat. Then keep your knees tucked in close and lower both knees down to your left, adding on a gentle twist. And use your breath to create space and release tension. Firm up your core and draw your knees back to center, switching sides. Both knees lower down to your right. Turn your chin to your left. Deepen your breath. Then make your way back to center. Coming back into your full wind pose. Feel free to add a little bit of movement here, rocking in your lower back, or take any other poses that call out to you before we seal off our practice today. And when you're ready, release your legs and make your way to your final Shavasana. Gently close your eyes, soften your jaw, and feel a wave of relaxation wash over your body. So your arms and legs become heavy and if only for a moment, you can completely let go.
Exhale everything from your lungs. Take a big inhale through your nose. Open mouth, let it go. One more time, inhale through your nose. Open mouth, let it go. Take your time as you roll over onto one side. And pause here in this tender transition. And when you're ready, press yourself up to seated. And with your hands together at heart center, rest your mind on your intention once more. The intention that chose you. And bring a gentle smile to your face. And allow yourself to continue to be open to opportunity. New ideas, new perspectives, and this new intention. Namaste.